Lou, we're getting to see what that search looks like this afternoon. Actually, we're looking at three of the search boats right now. Florida Fish and Wildlife here in the water. They've told us to stay back. So other boaters, make sure you're staying back in this area of the mouth of Julington Creek if you see those blue flashing lights. So we've been told by FWC they have three sonars out here right now searching this area. And the captain of the boat we're on right now says this water can be anywhere from 8 feet to 15 feet in some areas. And even in the shallower areas, though, very murky and lots of debris on the bottom. There could be trees on the bottom. There could be old debris from other crashes on the bottom. So it's it's not the easiest place to search and it's a pretty wide area that they're searching right now. And this is just what we can see. We know there are other first responders out here on the water this morning as well and throughout the afternoon. Remember, there is a 16 year old they are looking for and they say he as well as two others were on a canoe yesterday just before 8 p.m. when that canoe overturned. Those two others were able to swim to shore and that's not easy in this area. Mark Vick He's with Freedom Boat Club. He has us out on his pontoon right now. He tells us this is a very difficult area to swim. You got the currents, you got tides, you got people driving by in their boats, creating waves as well. So definitely not easy. On top of that, the water, very cold. This morning, a boater told us it was about 64 degrees. So hypothermia can occur in that temperature of water. Again, we are seeing right now those blue flashing lights. This is part of the search area. So if you are out in the water for this President's Day, if you see any flashing lights or any first responders, make sure you stay far away. This is an active search. Leah Shields, First Coast News on your side. Hey, good afternoon, everyone. The wind picking up out there just a little bit. You can see it's blowing out of the east.